This is a little song to say hello. Hi. Hi. Hi, 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 hi. Hello, welcome to Drinking Beer. I'm your host, John Plunkett. This is the first episode of 2011. And uh, for those of you who are watching this, thank you. This is going to be a unique experience for Drinking Beer and myself as though we are two separate entities, apparently. Last year, I actually started the series, Drinking Beer, in late July, early August. So I really only did a half a year. This year will be a full year of Drinking Beer episodes. So it'll be interesting to see how many I get through. Also, it'll be interesting to see how many new beers I can get my hands on, because as I noticed throughout 2010 and continuing on into the future now, I've been able to get my hands on a lot of nice beers that I really didn't have access to before. So what's the first beer of 2011 going to be? Well, since it's a special sort of thing, I figured why not make it a special beer and do Bell's Batch 10,000. This is a commemorative brew. This is the bottle. See, Batch 10,000. Ooh, look at that light. Kind of a sweet aroma. Let's get it in the glass. I'm, I feel like I'm rushing it, but trust me, I'm not. Oh my lord. That is dark, 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 dark. It may look black, but it's not. It's very opaque brown, very stool waterish. I've said that before about beers, so. Mm. <sighs> kind of reminds me of a Belgian ale. That's probably where they're going with it. Just the, the look of it, the smell of it. I, I'm leaning towards a Belgian. I, I'm not gonna speculate anymore. What it is, is it's Bell's Batch 10,000. And I'm gonna drink it now. Cheers. Mm-hmm. As soon as my lips touched it, I knew it, Belgian ale. Wow, I really know how to pick them, don't I? I think if you're familiar with my series, you know I, I don't really like wheat beers and I'm not really a big fan of Belgian ales, so. This is a strong dark ale, strong dark ale. Very strong. I gotta hand it to you. You've created a beer that I now have to look up. I did a little research. And uh, I guess this beer is just kind of a mishmash of different hops and malts and everything that they could find is just thrown into a kettle and made up into a beer. So it's not even a Belgian ale. It's just an experiment by Bell's. I have another drink. So that was my review of Bell's Batch 10,000 commemorative brew. Um, I'd have to say overall, I didn't like it. If you can afford to buy it, pick up a six pack and give it a shot. Let me know what you think, although no one ever has. Some people have, I shouldn't say that, some people have. That was my first review of 2011. To hope the rest of the year isn't as disappointing as that was. And until we meet again, my name is John Plunkett and this has been Drinking Beer. Happy trails and keep drinking.